Welcome to day 12 of League One. We start our highlights with Lille's convincing win against rivals Monaco. Best defence of the championship, Lille can also score. Nolan Roux making the best of Basha's header to beat Suvazic. A supersonic counter-attack gave Lille a second. Roux again on the score sheet, perfectly assisted by Rio Mavuba. Lille win 2-1. Monaco lose for the first time of the season. Paris without Ibrahimovic hosted Lorient de Bac des Princes. Not a problem for the Parisians who can count on many other stars such as Lucas opening the score on a digne assist. Verratti then puts Menez in ideal position for Paris' second. Just before the break, Lucas on the right-hand side crosses over to Edinson Cavani, his eighth goal so far. The Cavani show continues in the last minutes. Rabiot's headers is cleared, but not for long. Cavani becomes League One's top scorer and Paris win 4-0. At Montpellier, Nantes started in style. Philippe Djordjevic making the best of a Sissoko strike to beat Jodrin. In the last moments of the game, Jamel Bakar saves Montpellier thanks to this strike. 1-1 is the final score at La Mousson. Tough test for Marseille at Rennes and difficult start for the Southerners. Nelson Oliveira beats Mandanda on this powerful strike. Minutes later, Abdallah on the right crosses over to Jordan Ayew for Marseille's equaliser. Much more like it for OM, but still not good enough. Reims are the good surprise of League One and De Préville confirmed that against Bastia, opening the score. Krishoviak adds a second on a penalty. In the second half on a corner, Bastia hit back on a Romaric header. But the Corsican nightmare continues with Landreau failing to clear correctly. Prince Oniang scoring a fourth goal in four games. Albeck then, with the assist, helps Attar with the fourth. Eventually, this fine Kasri free kick won't be good enough to prevent a heavy 4-2 defeat. After that draw against Paris, Saint-Étienne were away at Sochaux. No goals, but quite a few opportunities for the home side, starting with this Noguera strike saved by Ruffier. The Saint-Étienne keeper, man of the match, stopping Cédric Bacambu's header shortly later from close range. It eventually finished goalless. Nice hosted Bordeaux and struggled at home. Jussier in the area managed to launch Grégory Sertic for this fabulous strike that would put Bordeaux in front. It was a question of long-distance strikes at the Allianz Riviera Stadium. First Sertic, then Obraniak. Eventually, Dario Zvitanic put Mnis on the score sheet, but that wouldn't be good enough as the home side lose 2-1, a first defeat in their new stadium. Lyon needed to win and did just that against Guingamp. First, thanks to Alexandre Lacazette making the best of a defensive hiccup. Bafetimbi Gomis launched by an opponent, added a second. Minutes later, two goals in two games for Gomis. Lyon win 2 0. A good start for Toulouse gave them hope, not victory against Evian Aurier. Managed a fine volley from close range, but that would only be an illusion. 
shortly later. Sabali with the strike that ends up being a cross for Vass. If Yon equalise, a last minute penalty will give the home side the win. Mongongu with a decisive goal if Yon win 2 1. It was do or die for Ajaccio and their manager Fabrizio Ravanelli, and it started dreadfully for the Corsicans against Valenciennes. Pujol opening the score after a great VA 1 2 just outside the area. Rudy Mata own goal would keep Ajaccio's hopes alive just before half time. But Ravanelli's nightmare continued during the second period. Pujol crossing over to De Sevi for Valenciennes to lead 2 1. And soon 3 1 thanks to Pujol's double. Ajaccio lose 3 1 at home. Game over. And Arrivederci to Ravanelli. Sacked. 28 goals scored during this championship weekend. All important victories for Paris against Lorient and Lille at home against Monaco. Lyon are back on track after their win against Guingamp. Only two away wins, Valenciennes at Ajaccio and Bordeaux at Nice. In the league standings, Paris lead the way with a two-point advantage over Lille, now second. Monaco a third, three points adrift. Not remain fourth, followed by Marseille and Reims surprising sixth. In the second half of the standings, Nice are 11th, just ahead of Lyon. In the drop zone are Valenciennes, Ajaccio and Sochaux last. Day 13 starts on a Friday with a game between Monaco and Evian. On Saturday, Paris host Nice. On the Sunday, Bordeaux-Nantes, Marseille against Sochaux and the derby between Saint-Étienne and Lyon.